Hey guys, so a few weeks ago I was perusing Instagram and I saw a post from Joe showing a batch of V-blocks he had made. And uh, when I saw it I was thinking, I bet he's selling those. Why else would a person need that many V-blocks? And uh, it turned out he was, so I picked up a set. The blocks came padded in these Cobra Frames shop rags. That was a nice touch. And uh, a bunch of stickers. Here is the V block. This is the rocker side. And this is the flat side. I didn't think to ask Joe how large these would be. I know Joe runs a bridge port, so. I was a little worried they'd be too large for my mini mill, but I was uh, pleasantly surprised at their size. They measure around 45 millimeters long by 30 millimeters by 15. So the magic happens when you need to fasten a tapered tube, like a chain stay or a seat stay. The uh, rocker side allows for the V-blocks to make full contact on the tube. While on the outer sides, the jaws clamp the flat side and the rocker side. Here I am dropping them into my mini mill vise, and uh, they fit, I dare say, perfectly. If they were any larger, I don't think the jaws would be tall enough, and any smaller would limit the diameter tube I put in there. I'm going to uh, run a test cut on this chainstay with a slitting saw. Kind of like uh, you would for a dropout. Here I uh, sped up the video a bit. I'm actually not moving this fast. And there it is, pretty good. And then I thought, why not flip it and notch it? So a little disclaimer, Joe is not paying me to make this video or anything like that. I wanted to uh, show these off because they're really well suited for you guys with a small shop like mine, uh, running a mini mill like mine. I also uh, wanted to make the video because Joe is always helping me out with uh, good tips and stuff. So thanks, Joe. If you're interested in picking up a set, you can contact Joe at joe at cobraframes.us. You can also reach Joe from his website, cobraframes.us. Happy notching, cutting, filing, or whatever you do with your V-Blocks. I'll see you guys later.